We're here with Mark Richardson today. Uh, Mark, am I right in saying, have you missed any of the New Zealand Open tournaments that we've had in mm. Queenstown? Oh, I've been at the tournament from the start. I Since the minute, it, the minute it began as a, as a, as a pro-am format, I was there, boots and all. Yeah, I love it, really? absolutely love it, yeah. Oh, that's great. So, and and uh, just formally announcing, I guess, that you're back again uh, in 2016, no show without punch. Yeah, well, went well last year. You, you went know, really well. Blew, blew it. Um, I'm still actually quite annoyed with the way I played the last few holes because yeah. me and my partner, Chris Muick, were, I mean, he was in with a shot of winning the tournament. Oh, and what? I think we got ourselves to the top of the pro-am with yeah. about three to go. Right. And then, um, And then we both pooed the bed, so to speak. <laughs> I'm still fuming. <laughs> it's called pressure. It's called pressure. You must be used to that by now. So, uh, so obviously, uh, as a result of that uh, uh, near miss last year, you've been working on your game, and uh, you've been working with Institute of Golf. What 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 changes have they made to your, to your golf? Uh, they're just trying to make my swing more consistent. Uh -huh. uh, I rely on timing so much, as a lot of us former cricketers do. We all strike the ball well, yeah. um, but and have high swing speeds, yeah. but we're mechanically not quite right, so you rely on timing. So after a few practice rounds down the hills, I, I start getting it, my timing. Yeah. Um, but then I'll go out, having not played for four months, say in the middle of the year, and, and it'll be awful. Yeah. So he's tried to get the mechanics, or Craig Dixon has tried to get the mechanics of my swing right. Yeah. Um, but I am noticing that there's an art to playing sport. Yeah. You know, and, and the, you can have the greatest mechanics on earth, but you've got to learn how to play the sport, and that means playing it more. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's the toughest part of our golf, isn't it? Finding enough time, especially in your busy life. Yeah, it is. Unfortunately, it's it's a five hour commitment when you yeah. think about a four and a half hour round and yeah. probably five and a half hours. So yeah. I probably don't have that in the weekends, working yeah. both ends of the day, you know, spend that with my kids. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but during the cricket season, uh, I'm coming to a golf course near you. I'm probably probably going to sneak on at 6 o'clock in the morning, but... Actually, I've heard yeah. that. I've heard that uh, <laughs> Hamilton uh, St Andrews police are after you. Is that right? <laughs> yeah. In the middle of the cricket test? During the Hamilton test, I was getting up at 6 in the morning and, and jumping on there. And uh, it was a bit difficult putting, actually, because the sprinklers were always on. <laughs> so you had to, um, you had to duck, duck and dive the sprinklers. But yeah, the, unfortunately, um, being a recognisable face, um, it's not good for sneaking on golf courses. No, you've got to get yourself off yeah. television. Hey, uh, so back to Institute of Golf briefly. Have you? Uh, how would you rate rate what they've done in terms of in terms of progress for you? If you found it found it, you know, if you like scores out of ten, how have they been? Well, out of due respect for all the other teaching pros around there, I think if you want to make changes to your game, you come to the Institute of Golf because they have a methodology that is basically start from the ground up with the basics, get the basics right, go right back to the basics, work hard on those, and then, you know make the little fine tuning from there they don't just give you tips they don't look for quick fixes uh, they try to to build you from the ground up and, and that takes time so it's yeah. it's a commitment with these guys yeah. um, but it's a commitment that in the long run would pay dividends for everyone i think wow interesting interesting